to another edition of Silo Design Solutions Tips and Tricks. Today we're going to cover how to manipulate structural wall footings. So typically in your elevation and 3D views, the only way to manipulate a structural wall footing was to split the wall. And then you could delete that portion of the structural footing. And I'll just show that here. So if we go to our Modify tab, we use the Split Element tool. We cut our wall, and then we have that separate piece of footing. This is how we typically be able to adjust those footings. Now, in 2020 and up, if you were to work in your plan view, notice here you do have these grips, which the grips are shown in 3D as well, but the plan view also allows you to be able to manipulate the length of these particular footings as well. It's a lot easier in your plan view, but if you don't have the option to be able to manipulate the footings within your 3D and or your elevation views, remember you can always do that here in your plan views. Thank you for your time. Have a great day.